Oh, hello, Mrs. Thurst. I'm just going to have another go at putting that cannula in you. Um, this IV in you, this cannula. I'm sorry about all that. Oh, I'm feeling like a bit of a pin cushion. Look, don't worry. I'm sure we'll get it this time. It'll be fine. Oh, better put this under your pillow. Let me get ahead of it. I'm going to stick it in up here this time because it's a bigger vein. It'll be easier to access. Okay. Do you think I could have it down here though, so I can move my arm? Right. Okay. Well, it would be easier to get it in up there though. Can't do that till it's actually dried. So I just. Do you think we could get somebody else to have a go? Somebody with a bit more experience? Okay, if that's what you want, Mrs. Thirst, it's up to you. Just need to warn you though, your veins are like rubber tubes. I think they'll have problems as well. Hello Mrs Thurst, I'm Darren, I'm one of the nursing staff. They've asked me to come and pop a drip in your arm today, so yeah. Oh, looks like they've had a couple of goes, you poor thing, hey? Mm. All right, let's see how we go. Alright, I'm just going to pop a tourniquet around your arm. We'll just see what your veins are like there. Okay. We'll go down here on your arm so then you can move your arm around, alright? Okay, there's a nice one there. This is just some prep solution. Just let that dry. Doesn't take too long. Okie dokes now. Unfortunately, this is going to hurt a little bit, okay? Nice and still for me. There we go. That's it. All done. Okay. That's awesome. Oh, good. And dressing on.
This is just some salty water to give it a flush just so that doesn't clot up. Not hurting at all? No? no? Feels alright? Yeah, okay. Just making sure I've got the date and time on your dressing so we know when to change it or take it out. There we go. All done. Thank you.